well, we are at just a few minutes to start the last class. Hello, Mariela. Hello. Hello. How are you tonight? Tell me. Fine. Fine. Very fine. Okay, today is the last class. Ah, oh, I see. <laughs> uh, look at the bright side. Tomorrow you're going to be resting. Tomorrow I am um, I am um, babysitting. Oh yeah, you told me <laughs> yesterday that you're gonna be babysitting. That's interesting. Okay, yes. help me out, Mariela. Me echa una mano. Eh, tengo que probar los micrófonos. Eh, este es el número uno. Este es el número dos. Ese es mejor. Y este es el número tres. El dos, el, number two. El anterior. Entonces, yes. este. Ok, perfect, perfect. Okay. Yeah, because I try different. You know, it's weird. Sometimes, uh, depending on how the signal is, sometimes the first one works better than the second one or the third one. Mm, it varies. So, how was your day, Mariela? Tell me. Is um, easy. Oh, really? It was easy, an easy day? That's cool. Yes. What, what time did I you finish, get home? Finish. Yes, tell me, tell um, me. At uh, 7. At 7? Seven? 7 o'clock. Mm. Yes, I, I'm, I'm go, I, I'm go to shopping. I went. I went, yes. I went, I went shopping. To shopping. I went yes. shopping, okay? The verb is the two shopping. words. In este caso, el verbo son las dos palabras. Go shopping. So in past, went shopping. Oh, really? Wow. What did you buy? Tell me. Shopping. Tell me. Tell me. I'm curious. Tell me. What did you buy? I, I buy I four bought, dresses. I bought. I bought. Yes. Bought um, another. Four another dresses? Color. Yes. You bought four dresses? Wow. Why so many? You're gonna have parties? Uh, no. Just for kicks. Solo porque yes. sí. That's cool. Yes. That's nice. Okay, what colors are your um, dresses? Uh the first flowers. Okay. Number two, green and black. Black and green, perfect. Number, number three, beige. Beige, okay, and the fourth one? And for um, let me see. Gray. Okay. Gray. Gray. Hmm. Oh, entonces compré cinco. Five. Oh, oh my gosh, you got five dresses. Yes, gray, wow. and one is is my favorite is black. Okay, with cool. with glitter 
All right. <laughs> with glitters? Mm, interesting. Yes. That's interesting. That's a, yeah. that's a night dress then. Yes. It's a night dress. That's the one that you could use for at night. Yes. Okay, yeah, that's nice. That's nice. Yeah. yeah. Y he decidido usar solo vestido. Oh, really? Yeah, no. Yes. That's nice. That's nice. It's more yeah, no, feminine. No, no more pants for me. Okay, that's interesting. So you're going to be very feminine. Yes. Yeah. And elegant. Y también porque ten, tengo un problema de que adelgazo mucho. Y oh, really? Eso. Yeah, and, no. the, and the clothes, they don't fit no more. Yes, entonces con los pantalones es yeah, It's a big problem. Cuando, ajá, entonces un vestido es como que, ah, me queda flojo, pero me, me lo pongo así. Yeah, you can just use a little lace or perhaps a, a belt. There are yes. different ways to solve it, or perhaps a little fixing. Uh, yes. I know, I know, mm -hmm. I know. I know about okay. that. I know about that. I grew up fixing ladies' dresses. Yo crecí arreglando vestidos de mujer. And I like more dresses. Oh, really? Yeah, me too. Yes. You know what? With my mama, we used to, we used to, we used to sue. We used to sue. Mm -hmm. We used to sew dresses, mostly uh, wedding dresses. I don't like wedding dresses. <laughs> well, no, the thing is that I, um, I was telling you that uh, when I was young, yeah. I used to work oh. sewing wedding dresses. Yes. I, I, I... What I, I what I'm going to put no, no, no. Me neither, and I work with them for a long while. Yo tampoco y trabajé con ellos mucho tiempo. Because that's what we did. I mean, we used to do uh, wedding dresses, we used to do uh, party dresses also. Hacíamos vestidos de novia, de fiesta. We used to do a lot with my mama. So that's when cool. I was when I was a kid, I learned how to how to sew. También me gusta coser. Oh yeah, really? Me too. I can do yes. it. Actually, I have I have a uh, I have a machine, and sometimes I do little things. I don't have a machine. I sew, sew, as you say. Yeah. Or I sew um, with uh, to hand. By hand, by hand. By hand, yes. Yeah, me too. I can do that. Interesting talking to you, Mariela. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Natalie, hello Natalie. I was missing you yesterday. Where were you? <laughs> Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Uh, I feel a bit early. I'm sorry. Yesterday I feel asleep early. I fell. I fell as I fell asleep early. Wow. Fell that's asleep. Cool. That's nice. Yes. Look at the lady. She went to sleep very early. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> that's nice that's nice really what time did you go to sleep yesterday sorry what time did you go to sleep yesterday seven. let me see quiero ver let me see seven Oh, I think we are having problems with the connection, Natalie, because I lost you. Okay, don't worry, Natalie, I will get back to you later. Don't worry, don't worry. Let's see who else is around. Walter, hello, Walter. Hello, teacher. How are you? Uh, very well, teacher. Really? Yeah. How was your day, mister? And the day um, difficult. Um, much, uh, and much work. Really? A lot of work? Yes. A lot, a lot of work. A lot of work. Oh, that's interesting. Yes. 
So you had a heavy day. Tu un día ocupado. Yes. Look at the bright side. Look at the bright side. Tomorrow you don't have classes. You are going to rest. So tomorrow you're going to be cool. Yes. That's yes. nice. That's nice. Excellent. Excellent. Correct. Thank you, Walter. You're welcome, teacher. Felicita. Hello. Good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. How are you tonight? Very good. Very good. Family. Oh, that's family. nice. That's yeah. nice. To be with the yeah. family, it's always great. So, yeah. how was your day, Felicita? Did you have a good day? Um, normal day, teacher. A normal day. So, normal working, day. regular stuff. Yeah. That's nice. That's nice. What time did you get home today, Felicita? Um, fix, fix PA. Five, 5 p.m. Five, five, five p.m. Oh, that's nice. Early. Yeah. So you relax, took a shower, had dinner. Yeah. Ooh, excellent. That's nice. That's nice. That's great. You are ahead of me. In my case, I have dinner until I finish. Well, mm. sometimes. Yeah, but the thing is that they're preparing pupusas and I don't like them. So... <laughs> Today is not a good day for me. No. Well, thank you, Felicita. Welcome to the class. You're welcome. Hey, Carlos. Good evening. How are you? Good evening, everybody. How are you today, mister? How was your day? Tell me. Uh, very hard because today I uh, make... Uh, 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 some uh, reports. Oh, really? Made, 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 made. Uh, 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 some. Okay. Uh, okay. Listen to me. Made some re reports. Made some reports. Reports. Okay. So you made some reports. Oh, that's stressful. Yes, because today is the last day to present oh. a inventory of the November. So it was the, today was the deadline. Today was the deadline, la fecha limite. Ah, uh, deadline, correct. Today was the deadline or today was the due date. This is more formal, the due date. Due date, okay. This is formal, today was the due date. Today was the due date. For, uh, to turn oh nice to turn in turn in to turn in all the reports all the reports listen report, reports reports report. go like this look reports reports report. <laughs> remember that when you hit the the one that you hit stronger is the last one look reports report like that okay okay thank you carlos okay helen hello helen how are you miss mm, i think i lost helen she freezes let's see we're gonna talk with the little uh let's see little gray and pink hood Hello, Eliani. How are you? Good evening. Good evening. Very well, and you? Well, I see that you are very warm. Veo que está muy cálida. That's nice. Uh, this day, I have been very cold. Oh, really? Yeah. But today is not cold. Yesterday was cold, but today... Other... It's very day. <laughs> Ah, come on. Yesterday, well, for me, yesterday was worse. Today is acceptable. Yeah. Because, let me see, yesterday I went to sleep at 1 a.m. So, uh, the room that I have for working, I need to go through the patio 
because this is another room in my house. So I needed to go through the patio in order to get to my bedroom. Man, that was cold. Yesterday was very cold. Today is very, very cold. Today is acceptable. Come on, Eliane, don't believe it. Uh, and all of wind, yeah. uh, The wind is it's strong. Okay, let's see who's Hold on, thank you very much, Eliani. Somebody's reporting to me. Oh, Helen is having problems with the Wi-Fi, she told me. Yes, Helen, no problem, no problem, Helen. Just listen to me, okay? Let's see who else is around. Francisco, hello, Francisco. Good evening. How are you, mister? Good evening. How I'm are fine. you? Great, fine, fine. great. Okay, what about you, teacher? I'm just fine. Let me ask you, Francisco, what is, what is your hobby? Tell me. My hobby, um, there are two hobbies, to play soccer and um, walk to the mountain. Oh, really? Yeah. That's nice. So you like cross-country walking, cross-country walking. Cross-country walking. walking. Um, <laughs> Walking in the walking in the woods, caminar por okay. los bosques. Yeah? yeah, that's yeah. what you like. That's cool. Yeah. That's cool. In my case, uh, you know, I can walk long distances, no problem. If I wow. have to, yo puedo caminar larga distancia si tengo que, but oh. not because I want to. You don't like? It. Not really. Um, I am more like a, for me the the the. For going out, I need to go where there's water. Okay, oh. for me it's like going to the beach, going to the swimming pool, going to to a lake, something like that. Something where I can swim. That's for me. I love okay. swimming. It's nice for me. It's um, it's important to explore the nature. I it's like cool. it. It's cool. Oh, you know what else I love is driving, driving long distances. Uh, out of the it's city tired it is, man. it's a little bit tiring you know like three weeks ago i went to let's see it was like 2 2 30 p.m i went from suchitoto i was at suchitoto close to suchitoto i went from there to uh, puerto la libertad then i went to el tunco from el tunco i went to sonsonate Wow. <laughs> All the literal and from Sonsonate coming back home. So it was fun. I like it. I like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like it's going like... long distances. It's okay. nice. For me, it's relaxing. Yeah, but for me, as it started, um, last year, I go to the... I North went. Pole. I went to Honduras, uh, the north from uh, Honduras. Um, and driving from San Pedro Sula to San Salvador, yeah, I was tired. Oh, uh, yeah, because, oh, well, you go up, then you go down. It's, yeah. Uh, it's complex. It's complex. I know. More I know what you mean. Eight hours. Yeah. Eight hours. Yeah. You know, uh, I went like that once. I went from here, from San Martin. I went to San Salvador. From San Salvador, I went to Chalate. From Chalate, I took the longitudinal until uh, Ciudad Barrios, and from wow. Ciudad Barrios to San Miguel, and then back here. Okay. Uh, <laughs> nice round. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It took me all day long. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but for me, that's fun. That's fun. Okay, okay. Thank you, yeah, Francisco. Good. Interesting. Thank you. <laughs> let's see, let's see who else is around. Fausto. Hello, Fausto. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, Fausto. Tell me, Fausto, what's your hobby? What do you like to do for having fun? My hobby? Yeah. Um, uh, first, uh, uh, play football soccer. Play soccer? Okay. That's the yeah, main thing. Um, That's your main hobby. Yeah. Um, also, um, uh, 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 
listen listen the music listen to music listening listen to listening, music. listening to music listening to music um for relax okay uh, uh only cool that's nice that's nice let me see. Okay, let's see. Somebody else is trying to connect. Thank you very much, Fausto. So that's nice. So you listen to music, you play, play. soccer. That's yeah. that's what you do when you want to relax. Son lo más importantes. <laughs> okay, that's nice. Excellent, excellent. Thank you very much, Fausto. Blanca, what about you? Tell me, Blanca, what's your hobby? Uh, good evening. My hobby is swimming. Really? Yeah, I like the swimming, but in these moments I don't practice because I can't. But I can't time. Okay. I don't have time. But when I finish my classes in the university, I return my sport. Okay, so. The main, the main, the main, the most important is, the most important for you is, hello Blanca, you freeze, se me congeló. My gosh, we are having problems with connection, I can tell. Okay, now you got, you're back Blanca, now tell me, what is the most important then? The number one hobby you got? Hello, Blanca. Yuhu. Hola, hola. Es que tengo problemas, creo. I can see, I can see, I can see. Don't worry, I'll be back. I'll get back to you later. Don't worry, don't worry. That's fine. Carla Marielos, good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Carla, I was here connected and you were not. You are always the first. What happened today? Tell me. I had very good day. Ah, you had a very good day. I wonder where you've been. Me pregunto dónde habrá estado. Hmm. You are very smiley. Interesting. Why is today that? Is my, today is my beard. Oh, congratulations. Hey, everybody, let's congratulate Carla. It's her birthday. It's her birthday. Happy birthday. Hey, Happy congratulations. Birthday. Congratulations. So, Happy birthday, birthday, Carla. Yeah, birthday. nice, nice, nice. So you turn... No queremos pastel. Yeah, everybody yes, wants cake. <laughs> everybody wants cake. Uh, <laughs> so today, Carla, you turn, you turn uh, 35, you told me, right? 24. Oh, I thought it was 35. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. 24. You're a little kiddo. You're a little kiddo, my dear. Gosh, that's nice. That's nice. Let's see. Well, al, al fondo le adornaron de vejiga. Yeah, I can see. I can see. And even here in the classroom, Jorge sent you a, a little message, the same Eliani, and she's got something there. Wow. So, Carla's been partying today. Ella ha andado de fiesta hoy. That's why. That's why she's like with yes. that happiness. Cool. Excellent. Congratulations. Thank you, Carla. Thank you. Let's see, Pedro. Good evening, Pedro. Hello. How are you? Hello. How are you, Pedro? Fine. Fine, thanks. Great, great. How was your day, mister? Uh, very, uh, uh, ¿cómo se dice? Uh, busy. Busy, very busy. Okay. Yes. Mm -hmm. That's nice, that's nice. It's good when we have something to do. Tell me, Pedro, what is your hobby? We are talking about hobbies today. Uh, my favorite hobby is... Uh, um ride the bicycle oh really yes ah, that's nice that's El nice marido, eh? that's nice yeah. mariela yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um, start the the uh, <laughs> to, to chitoto. 
really? That's nice. Yeah. That's nice. That's nice. Okay, just give me a second. Okay. Okay, I'm just sending a little message. Okay. Let's see. Well, that's nice. You know, Pedro, I love I when I was young, that long ago, cuando yo era joven, that way, way back. Yeah, because because I compared to Carla, man, I feel depressed, I feel sad. When I was young, I used to I used to love bicycling, but I used to I used to go from from San Marcos to San Diego. Wow. And then coming back. Very, very far. <laughs> yeah, the first time I almost cry. La primera vez casi lloro. It was terrible, <laughs> horrible, man. Believe me. Now, yeah, but now I think I cannot go even to, to the corner. Ahora creo que no llevo ni a la esquina. Yeah, I'm too old for that. Yeah, that's nice, but exercising is nice. It's good. Yes. Yes. Great, great. Yes. Thank you, Pedro. Okay, teacher. Grecia. Hello, Grecia. Grecia. Hello. Oh, I think Grace is having problems. Okay, let's see, let's see who. Hello, 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 hello Gracia, how are you? Hi, very good. Thank Tell you. me, Gracia, today we've been talking about hobbies. Let's see, Pedro likes bicycling, uh, Francisco loves walking on the woods, on the mountains. Uh, let's see, somebody here told me that loves swimming. I don't remember who. Man, I'm old. And what about you, Grecia? What's your hobby? My hobby is traveling. Traveling? Oh, that's expensive hobby. Yes. Okay. No sé cómo decirlo. O sea, no es tan usual porque exacto es. Yeah, it's not that common. Ocupamos dinero. Yeah, it's not that common, but where do you love? Sí. Of the places that you have visited, why, which is the one that you loved to visit the most? The number one for you, which is? The beach. Okay, which is your favorite beach? Tell me. The Cuco Beach. La oh, nice. Beach. Nice, nice. Yes. I like El Cuco. I, actually, I'm sorry, but I love more the Las Tunas. It's nice. It's very nice. Yes. Ah. It's very nice. Yeah, it's cool. It's cool. I love to go to the to the ocean. It's nice. It's beautiful. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Thank you, Gracia. Miss Colocho, good evening. How are you? Good evening. How are Hi. you? Tell me. Tell me, Miss Colocho. What is your hobby? What do you like to do? Um, my hobby is watch TV. To watch TV? Okay. Your hobby is cheap. El suyo es barato. Eh, no problem. You don't spend that much money. That's cool. Okay, tell me, what's your favorite type of movies? And uh, I love, love dramas. Or, oh my gosh. No. <laughs> I love dramas. You are killing me here. You are killing me here. I'm a guy, please, for God's sake. Okay. Yeah, in this culture, in this culture, in this country, if you are a man, you don't watch Me those. Too. En este país, en esta cultura, si somos hombres, no vemos eso. Yeah, that is not acceptable. I don't know. Carlos, do you like doramas? Thank you, Carla. Okay. No. no? Okay, tell me, Carlos, what's your hobby? And my hobby is uh, soccer. Playing soccer. That's football. what. That's what relaxes. Okay, football or soccer. The two. Both. Because I I see I watch the. the American football. Of Patriots. 
Oh, really? You go for Patriots? Yes. Okay. Okay. Tell me, who's the best quarterback for you? <laughs> eh, quarterback, el que se fue. <laughs> Any? Peyton? I don't see, I don't watch all the match because the match are very long. Yeah, they so, are. Yeah, they are, they are. Well, and sometimes I don't have uh, a lot of time. Yeah, well, Peyton Manning was good. That guy was good. He was excellent. Yeah, that's nice, that's nice. So let's see, let's see, let's see. Thank you very much, Carlos. Jorge, tell me, Jorge, what is your hobby? What do you like to do when you want to have fun? My hobby is skydiving. Skydiving? Yes. Really? Yes. Cool. That's nice. Yes. Where do you practice that? Uh, with uh, FESAPADE, Federación Salvadoreña de Paracaidismo y Aerodeportes. That's cool. Okay, tell me, when was the first time? How old were you the first time you did it? ¿Cuántos años tenía la primera vez que lo hizo? Um, 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 uh, I practiced uh, science. Since? Science? Since? since? Three, three years. Okay. Oh, since three, three years ago. Three years ago, yes. Okay. Well, it's good. You gotta, you gotta have good legs. Tiene que tener buenas piernas. You gotta run a lot, man. Yes, yes. You need yes. your strength on your legs. Yes. Yeah, I remember when when you take the course of of, of of parachuting. That's parachuting. When you take the course of parachuting, man, everything is running. Cuando se toma el curso de paracaidismo, todo es correr. Yes, pero este los militares. Yeah. Well. I'm sorry, that's the only one I know. That's the only one I know, but yeah, I, it's true in the in the Air Force. I mean, you run for breakfast, you run for training, you run to go to class, you, go, you run for lunch, you run for everything. All day long you spend your day like running. It's cool, nice. It's very interesting and not quite common. Thank you, Jorge. Okay. Yeah, that's nice, that's right. nice. Let's see who is missing. I, I still got, yeah, I got time for one. Let's see who am I going to ask. Mariela, what's your hobby? Everybody here is, is asking me, what's Mariela's hobby? Tell me. My hobby is dancing. Dancing? Yes. Okay, what's your... And play video games. Oh, really? You love playing video games? Yes. That's cool. Fausto says he approves. Okay, tell me, what's your favorite video game? Uh, the Legend of Zelda. Oh, Zelda, that's a classic. That's yes. a classic. I remember, play, I remember playing the first Zelda back in the days. Wow, it was early 90s. Recuerdo haberlo jugado en los, a inicio de los 90, the very first version. Yes. Uh, it's cool. Salía una cascada, sí. Yeah, I am that old. Papi I am that old. Yeah, I am that old. Yo soy así de viejito. I remember that. I remember I play, that. I play this too. Yeah, I but, play that too. But I, I played Atari and I played Sega Genesis. Those were old, very old, believe me, even before Nintendo. I used in to, arcade? Yeah, I used to go to an arcade and to play. In the machines? Yeah, I used to. I used to play Pac-Man in an arcade. I am that old. Me too. And Samurai Spirits. Oh, Samurai was, Spirits. Yeah, that was good. Very um, nice. Soul Calibur. Uh, I knew it, but I wasn't that much into that one. It, it's an arcade. Yeah, I remember. I remember, but I knew it. Lo conocí, but it was not my favorite. Ah, interesting, uh, interesting like hobby. Cool, thank you, Mariela. Let's see. You're welcome. In, in my case, my, my, my favorite, favorite hobby is reading. I love reading. 
that's the number one hobby I got, reading. I love reading, mostly novels. I read a lot. I, I read around what? Scary. Two, uh, well, some, some actually. I read around two or three books per week. So I read a lot. I spend a lot of time reading. Uh, that's and it's been my hobby since I was oh I started reading like reading reading when I was 10 and then I haven't stopped yet Todavía no he parado. it's fun it's fun hey guys it's been wonderful having this conversation it's good have you noticed have you noticed that in this conversation that I have had with uh, everybody here have you noticed that uh, I was counting between the whole group? They were said just 10 words in Spanish. Fui contando y por todo el grupo solo se dijeron 10 palabras en español. That's excellent. Mm -hmm. That's actually great. Congratulations to everybody. That's nice. I mean, everybody's been practicing. I know that for some of you, it was like hard at the beginning. Now I can tell that you are comfortable comfortable with speaking and it doesn't matter if you make a mistake i mean this is class so don't worry okay guys well oops time's running i need to take the attendance so let's see let's see fausto antonio landa verde present thank you carla marielos guevara callejas carla marielos present Thank you. Mariela de Los Angeles Alvarado Present. Díaz. Present. Thank you. Carla Díazet Colocho de Parada. Present. Eliani Alejandra Nativir Rivera. Present. Thanks. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present. Soy la Noemí Córdoba de Valencia. Carlos Alberto Bautista Bonilla. Present. Thank you. Yesenia de Lourdes Magaña Sandoval. Let's see. No, here I could swear I saw her. No, it was just my mind. Okay, let's see. And Jorge Alexander Reyes Lopez. Thank you. Blanca Margarita Chavez Perez. Present. Felicita Cruz de Pereira. Present. Grecia Yulisa Pereira de Villegas. Present. Helen María Chávez Quintanilla. Present. Giovanni Vladimir Escamilla Gómez. Here. Francisco Javier Villatoro Canales. Present. Thanks. Alonso Antonio Turcios Brizuela. Andrea Natalie Espinalo Manzoro. Present. Wendy Susana Perez, absent. Pedro Antonio Hernández. Martin teacher. Thank you very much. Let's see. Oh, there's, 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 there's Noemi. Soy la Noemi. Let's see. Soy la Noemi Córdoba de Valencia. I present, please. Mm. I lost her. I think she's having problems with the connection. Okay, cool. Okay, guys, let's see. Before we continue, antes que continuemos, let me just uh, mention something. Quiero mencionarles un pequeño detalle. I'm sorry, I need to post this problem. I'm sorry, now we are back on track. Okay, so remember, just for those little ones who are missing the, the little detail in the platform, please do it because the rest of you, wow, guys, Almost a hundred, a hundred. That's nice. That's nice. Let's see. And let me check just something. Let me check just something. Uh, I need to be sure of this. Let's see. And oh, also Blanca, Blanca, you're missing the final test, right? So please, Blanca, I need it tomorrow noon. Okay. So 
Let's continue. Today, we are going to continue talking about where we are going to make a small review about everything. And we are going to talk a little bit about uh, can and could. That's something that appears in the, in the lessons, right? In the exercises. Can and could. It's very simple, guys. Do you remember that we were talking about requests and we were saying that uh, would is polite, right? Would is polite. And would is used for future requests, okay? And sometimes for present. Now, if you have seen the exercises from the platform, you have can and could. Could usually, I've been telling you, most of the time that we use could when we talk about the past. Les he dicho que usamos could cuando hablamos del pasado, right? But also, we use it when we want to make a polite request. También usamos cuando queremos hacer una petición amable. But this request is in the present. Like, imagine that I'm talking to Fausto and I'm telling, hey, Fausto, could you open your microphone, please? You see? I said, cool. I am being very polite, right? But imagine that me and Fausto, we are friends, we get together sometimes, we are neighbors, okay? We know since a long time, nos conocemos desde hace mucho, and I call him, hey Fausto, what's up, man? Hey, can I go, can I come over to your house? You see, can, can I come over to your house? It's a request, but as we are friends and we get along pretty fine, como somos amigos, nos llevamos bien, I use can. I am making a request, but it's informal. So when we want to make an informal request, we use can. Are we clear up to here? ¿No entendemos hasta acá? Yep. Yes. Remember, can, informal. Could, informal. I mean, could, formal, can, informal, right? My bad. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. It's like a, another example could be like I tell, Hey, Walter, can I go play soccer with you next Saturday? You see, I'm asking here, can I go play soccer with you? So that's informal, right? It's different if I, if I tell him, hey, Walter, could you please finish the exercise? It's very formal. I'm talking very formal to him. That's the difference. Okay, just let me check on something because I got something here. Yesenia de Lourdes Magaña Sandoval. Present. Thank you. Let me put your name here, Yesenia. Perfect. Okay, now you are no numbers no more. Hey, Yesenia, yes. you are very formal. Where are you? Hi. Hello, I where are you? I'm sorry? I am working. Oh, that's why she's very formal. I was like wondering because Yesenia is always like relaxed, cool. Now I it's know. different. Eh, that's the way it is. Okay, guys, as I was telling you, can and could, they have those two different ideas. Can is used for informal, could is used for formal. Jorge, you are raising your hand? No. Well, you got your little hand there, me parece. Okay, don't worry, never mind, no importa. Okay, guys, I was explaining this because we are going to go straight to the conversation, the conversation that appears in your manual. This conversation is in page number 47. And in that conversation, we are going to practice the use of can and could. Just let me fix a little something here. Perfect. This is right. Now we are going to practice the conversation. Oh, by the way, we are going to do the the the, the survey a little bit later on. Vamos a hacer la, la encuesta un poquito más allá because we are going to wait for the person who's going to come and help us. Vamos a esperar por el chico o la chica de, de soporte que nos va a acompañar. Okay? I expect around 9 to 9.15. Espero que entre las 9, 9.15. The latest. Okay, now let's see. Let's continue. Uh -huh. Share. Okay, I'm going to share the screen with you right now. And this is it. Okay, look, this is the conversation we got. And the conversation goes like this. Hello, this is Max from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Joe. 
I work for Pips. Come, Pips.com. We received the new printer and I need help setting it up. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joe. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Uh, it's an Ultipage MX30. Okay, first, make sure that the power cord is plugged in. All right, it is. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Second, check that the installation CD is in the tray. And third, once the menu appears on the screen, click on Complete Install. I repeat. Hello. I'm sorry, I need to mute everybody. Okay, this is better. Hello, this is Max from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Joe. I work for pips.com. We received the new printer and I need help setting it up. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joe. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Can you hold on a second, please? Oh, it's an old page MX30. Okay, first, make sure that the power cord is plugged in. All right, it is. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Second, check that the installation CD is in the tray. And third, once the menu appears on the screen, click on Complete Install. Okay, I repeat one last time. Just let me send the picture for everybody so you can have it there, there, there. Okay, 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 okay. Just give me a second. Mm, this way is better. I'm sorry, guys. Me and cameras are not good friends. There you go. I repeat. Hello, this is Max from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Joe. I work for pips.com. We received the new printer and I need help setting it up. Could you help me please? No problem, Joe. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Uh, it's an Ultipage MX30. Okay. First, make sure that the power cord is plugged in. All right, it is. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Second, check that the installation CD is in the tray. And third, once the menu appears on the screen, click on Complete Install. Questions about the vocabulary, guys? Do you have any question? No? What's the meaning of a... Uh, uh, Pips. Pips. That's the name of the company, Pips. Plug it, plug it, teacher. Plug it in. Plug in, okay, Plug Con in. connect. Connect, conectar. Connect. Ah, connect. Thank you, teacher. Any other word? Power cord. That's the el cable de corriente. Um, That's the power cord. No more. Upper, up, up, upper, upper. Mm. On the menus, paper on the screen. Appears, appears, Appear. appears, Appear. aparece. Uh, thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Okay, now what I need you to remember is this. 
something very important. Look at the way uh, Joe, look at the way Max and Joe introduce themselves. He says, hello, this is Max from Tech Support. Look at how Joe answered. Hi, Max. In that case, uh, this is something that we need to, uh, to, 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 to remember, okay? In English, in, in American English, in the United States, people commonly use, they refer to each other in a first name basis. It's very common. People talk about, talk to each other sometimes in a first name basis in some situations. In algunas ocasiones las personas se hablan en, en primer nombre. That's the way you understand it is an informal conversation. De esa manera sabemos que es una conversación informal. Okay? When you start with hi, hello, a conversation, it's informal. Okay? It's different if you start like good morning, good evening. Imagine that in the conversation, the person that answers says, uh, good morning. This is Douglas Arevalo from Tech Support. How can I help you? In this case, it is formal, okay? In that case, it is formal when you say your full name, okay? Or when somebody starts using the title, o cuando comenzamos a utilizar el Mr., Miss, Mrs., okay? That's formal. In English, that's very, very formal when you start talking like that. Cuando comenzamos a hablar así, estamos hablando formalmente. Okay? It's like, uh, imagine that I talk to, to Noemi. Okay? In Spanish, it's quite common that I say, Hi, Noemi, how are you? Please answer to me, Noemi. I'm fine, thank you. In this case, in Spanish, no. if I tell her, Hola, Noemi, ¿cómo está? In Spanish, just the use of the usted makes it formal, no? more respectful, lo vuelve más respetuoso. But in English, we don't have that. In English, because the word you means for us both things. La palabra you significa ambas cosas para nosotros. It means tú o usted. So in English, Noemi knows that I'm speaking informally to her because I'm saying Noemi. Hi, Noemi, how are you? And she can answer to me in English, hi, Douglas, how are you? You see? It's different if I tell her, good evening, Miss Val Mrs. Valencia. She should tell me, good evening, Mr. Arevalo. It's different, you see? So, if you use the title in English, remember, si utilizamos el título, cuando digo título me refiero a Mr., Miss, Mrs., if we are using the title, we use it with the last name. Lo utilizamos con el apellido or with the full name. Okay? Never with the first name. Nunca con el primer nombre. I don't tell her, no le digo a ella, Hi, Miss Noemi. That is not correct. Eso no es correcto. We don't use Miss, Mr. or Mrs. with the first name. No lo utilizamos con el primer nombre. We okay. use it with the last name or with the full name. Okay. And that's what tells us if it is formal or informal. Okay, let's try it again. Let's see. Let's see who's going to help me. Uh, mm -hmm. Blanca. Good evening. Hello, Blanca. Hello, Blanca. How are you? Fine. Uh, please, would you mind addressing me for my name? Podría dirigirse a mí por mi nombre? Again, in English, please. Hello, Blanca. How are you? Hello, Douglas. I'm fine. Okay, perfect. Again, Blanca. Again. Good evening, Miss Chavez. How are you? Good evening, Mr. Douglas. I am fine. Mr. Arevalo. That's my last name, Arevalo. Okay, Mr. Arevalo. Okay, remember, never with the first name, Blanca. No con el primer nombre. 
Okay. okay, now let's go to practice the conversation. Any question about this? ¿Alguna pregunta con esto? No, it's clear. Perfect. Let's go do the conversation. Two minutes. Hurry up. We need to run today. We have many things to do. Let me see. I got uh, the groups. Perfect. Groups are created. Please jump in. Su 20 ya. Qué galán. She's a kiro, Helen. She's a kiro. Es una niñita chiquita. She's 24. Ay, qué galán. Yeah. Ya estoy viejita. Marielos, I was a father. I was a father of about two years old when I was your age. Yo tenía un hijo ya de más, casi dos años cuando tenía su edad. You are young, you are young. You still got a lot to live. Le falta por vivir mucho. Pero es, es, papá, es papá joven. Yeah, my son is 18 already. Mi hijo tiene 18. Sí, es mejor a veces. But it's hard. Hard. Very hard. Okay, let me see. Okay. Practice. Hello. Hello, Grecia. Would you mind doing me a favor? ¿Le importaría hacerme un favor? Okay, mister. Sálgase del breakout room because Mariela no sé por qué siempre la rebota y la saca. She's in the main room. You can practice there with her. Puede practicar con ella ahí. Ah, okay, perfect. Sí, ella entró por un segundo, pero salió yeah. rápido. Yeah, the platform okay. kicks her out. I'm sorry. Okay, perfect, mister. Thank you. You're welcome. I work for Bitcom. We receive the new printer and I need help. Hola, teacher. You practice with me right now. Okay. Es que creo que no logré entrar a ningún group. No, you are in a group. The problem is that... Uh, that. My connection. No, the other person. Oh, okay. okay. Hello. This is Max from Tech Support. How can I have you? Hi, Max. My name is Joe. I work for pips.com. We received the new printer. And I need help setting it up. Could you help me, please? No problem, yo. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Um, it's an Ultipage MX30. Okay, first make sure that the power cord is plugged in. Plugged in, plugged in. Plugged in. All right, it is. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Second, uh, check that the installation CD is in the tray. And third, once the menu appears on the screen, click on complete install. Perfect. So you don't need to practice no more, Blanca. Let's go back to the main room. Okay. Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Oh, it's a it's an ulti page MX theory. Okay, we make sure that the power cord is plugged plug, 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 plug in. Plug in. Thank you, teacher. Plug in. All right, it is. Could you tell me what and I need to next, please? 
Second, check that the installation CD is in the tray. And third, once the menu paper on the screen, click on completely ins install. Hi, okay. <laughs> Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. Hi. Now let's see, who's gonna be first? Who's gonna be first? Let's see. Hmm. 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 Let me see. Okay, perfect. We have to have three, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen. Perfect. Okay, who's gonna be first? Who's gonna be first? Now we are going to make it in a different order, okay? We are going to make it like this. Let's see, it's going to start again. You're gonna do it, you just did it, but you're gonna do it again. Felicita and Mariela, please, let's do it. You start, Felicita. Thank you, teacher. Hello, this is Mac from Fish Support. Who can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Joy. I work for Pips.com. We received the new printer and I need help setting it up. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joy. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Oh, it's a multi-page MX3. Okay, first, make sure that the power cord is closed in. All right, it is. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Second, check that the installation CD, it is in the tray and tier one the menu, paper on the screen, click on complete install. Okay, now let's see. Felicida, repeat with me, please. Tech, 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 tech. Complete. complete, complete, complete. Now, Mariela. Say it with me, look. You say it correct, but you say it slow. Setting it, setting it up. Now, repeat with me. Setting it. Setting it up, setting it up. Setting it up. Like that, perfect. Thank you. Now, let's see. Thank you, ladies. Now, Andrea, Natalie, and Blanca. Natalie, you start. Okay. okay. Hello. Hello. Excuse me, I think so. <laughs> Hello, this is Max from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is, is Joe. I work for Pete's Call. We received the new printer and I need help setting up. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joe. Could you tell me the, the model? Let me check. Uh, can you hold on a second, please? Uh, it's an uh, multi-page MX30. Okay. First, make sure that the power core is plugged in. All right, it is. Could you tell me what I need to, to do the next, please? Second, check that the Installation CD is in Detroit and tier once the menu appears on the screen. Click a complete, complete oh. install. Okay, guys. Now, support, support. And it was pips.com. En este caso, el punto lo decimos dat. D O T, okay, that. Okay. And plug, 
plugged in. Plugged. Plugged. Plugged in. Plugged in. Perfect. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, just give me a second, guys. I need to do something. Oh my gosh, what happened here? No, it was this. Okay, so next is going to be, let's see, okay. Ooh, Andrea, Blanca, um, Carlos, please, and Eliani. Okay. I start. Okay. I am Max. Okay. Hello. This is Max for Forum Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Joe. I work for Pierce.com. We reside the new printer and I need to help setting up. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joe. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on on a, a second, please? Oh, it's an multi page MX30. Okay, first, make sure that the power cord is plugging in. All right, it is. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Second, check that the installation CD is in the tray. And third, once the menu appears on the screen, click on complete install. Okay, guys. Receive. 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 Plug in. Plug, Plug in. Plug, Plug in. in. Perfect. So now let's see. Let's see. Next is going to be Pedro. And Miss Colocho, please. Hello, Pedro. Hello. Oh, okay, Pedro, you start. Yes, aquí estoy. Uh, um, voy a ver what's up, permite. Okay, no problem, no problem. Start. Please. Okay. okay. Hello. This is Mark from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hey, Max. My name is Joe. I wore the pips uh, that come. We received the new print and, uh, and I need help setting up. Call you help me, please? No problem, Joe. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on in second, please? Uh, it's uh, all the page MX30. Okay, first make sure that the power core and deploying. All right, it is. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Second check that the installation CD in the tray and third, once the menu appears, the scrape. Click, click on the complete start. Perfect. Now, tech, tech support. Tech plug support. in, plug in. Plug, plug in. Ah, okay. And appears, appears. Appear. Thank you very much, guys. Now let's see Noemi and Jorge, please. Jorge, you start. Okay. Uh, hello, this is Max from Super. How can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Joe. I've worked for Pips that come. We received an imprinter and I need help setting it up. Could you help me, please? Uh, no problem, Joe. Could you tell me the 
model? Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Oh, it's a um, multi page and X tree. Okay, first, uh, make sure that the power core is plugged in. All right, it is. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Second, check that the installation CD is in the tray. And third, once the menu, menu. menu appears on the screen, clicks on complete inst install. 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 Perfect, very well done. Thank you very much. Now, Francisco and Helen. Hello, this is Max from Tech Support. How can I hear you? Hi, Max. My name is Joe. I work for Pips.com, where I saved a new printer and I need help setting up. Call you help me, please? No problem, Joe. Call you, tell me the model. Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Oh, it's an, an, it's an ultimate mix theory. Okay, here make sure that the, that the power core on pocket, come on, pocket. Plug in, in. plug, plug in. 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 Clocks in. All right, it is. Could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Second, check that the install installation CD is in the tray, and see when the menu appears on the screen. Check on complete install. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Once, once, Helen. Um, one. Click, click, click in, click in. Thank you. Let's see who's missing. Fausto and Miss Carla Marielos. Okay. Hello. Uh, this is Max from Tech Support. How can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Joy. I work for Pix.com. We received the new panel and I need help starting it out. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joe. Could you tell me the model? Le let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? It's a uh, multi page NX Terry. Okay. Fears. Make sure that the power cord is plugged in. All right. It is, could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Second, check that the installation CD is in the tray. And there, once the menu appears on the screen, click on complete install. Okay, very well. Okay. Excellent. Let's see who's missing. Who's missing? ¿Quién me falta? ¿Quién me falta? I made it in the order. Eliani, I know you are missing, Eliani. And let's see. Grecia. Eliani, you did it already? One minute. Okay. Tick tac, tick tac, tick tac. Time for running. Ready. <laughs> okay, Eliani, you start. Hello, this is Max from Twitch Support. How can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Joy. I work for Pips. Come. We receive the new printer. Receive. And receive the new printer. 
and I need help setting up. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joe. Could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold, hold on a second, please? Oh, it's a multi page MFs. Third. Okay, first, make sure that the power cord is plugging in. All right, this is call, call you tell me what I need to do next, please. Second, check that the installation CD is, is in the drive and there one the, one the menu opens on the screen. Check, click on complete install. Okay, very well done. Thank you very much. Thank you, Eliane. Carlos and Yesenia. Okay. Yesenia, you start. Okay, hello, this is Max from Tech Support. Tech. Who... Hola. From Tech Support. Ah, from Tech Support. Who can I help you? Hi, Max. My name is Joy. I work for PEPS at home. We received a new printer and I need help setting it up. Could you help me, please? No problem, Joy. Could you tell me, uh, could you tell me the model? Let me check. Can you hold on a second, please? Uh, it's an ulti page, Max. Sorry. Yes. Okay, first, make sure that the power cord is deployed in. All right. It, could you tell me what I need to do next, please? Second, check that install installation CD is in the tray. And third, 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 third. Once, once the menu up, I no sé cómo se dice ahí. Appears. Appears on the screen, click on complete install. Okay. okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Listen up. How can I, how can I help you? How can I help you? How can I? Plug in, plug in. Plug in. Once. Once. And screen. Screen. Okay, guys, the time has come for us to do the, 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 the survey. Vamos a hacer el survey, okay? You have, all of you got your, the information they sent you? Tenemos la información que nos mandaron? Enlace. Yes. Que ya perdí, que no mando. Ay. Creo que les aparece como de parte de Elena, ¿no? Sí. Ok. para tomar la encuesta? Sí, les aparece el enlace para tomar en la encuesta. Please. Vaya, aquí, si alguno de ustedes, porque lo están haciendo en el teléfono, necesita datos del curso, yo los tengo acá frente a mí. Tienen orden de inicio. Esos son datos generales. Los otros son personales, ¿verdad? Sí. Vaya. ¿Orden de inicio la tienen? Sí. Si no, se la dicto. Ya. Dicto la teacher. Ok, ok. Vamos a esperar. ¿Quién más necesita? ¿Quién se está conectando aún? Bueno, orden de inicio. 
dos, seis, seis, ocho, siete. Repito los primeros números. Dos, seis, seis, ocho, siete. Sí, Noemi, le escuché que todavía no ha podido entrar. Yo le espero y se lo repito luego, no se preocupe. ¿A dónde mandó? No he entrado, el... teacher. No he entrado, teacher. Ok, ok, yo se lo repito de nuevo, no se preocupen. Los números se los voy a poner nuevamente. Ok, vamos a esperar un momentito para ver si podemos entrar todos. ¿Dónde es, es que el enlace a mí me, no me aparece bien. Donde dice enlace para tomar la encuesta. El enlace para tomar la encuesta creo que se lo mandaron al WhatsApp también, ¿verdad? Sí, es al final aparece el enlace uh -huh. del WhatsApp. Tendría que darle clic en leer más y luego les aparece el enlace. Sí. Ajá, pero no, no permite. Bueno, a mí me... No tengo el enlace. Ahora sí ya me lo pido. Ok. Sí. Sí, es un formato de okay, office.com. Sí. Ok. Si alguno okay. de ustedes está trabajando con computadora, lo tienen en el correo o lo tienen aquí en el chat, se los he puesto. Ok. Y vamos con orden de inicio, ¿verdad? Orden de inicio. Voy con los números. Dos, seis, seis. 8, 7. Guión 5, 9, 3, 0. Guión 0, 0, 6, 5. Aquí nos aparece una pleca 2020. Repito los números. 2, 6, 6, 8, 7. El número 6 dos veces. 5, 9, 3, 0. Un momento. 9, 3, 0. Ok. 0, 0, 6, 5. Luego, pleca 2020. 0065, ¿escucha? 0065. Pleca 2020. 2020. El proveedor es uh, inglés corporativo, entre paréntesis, Regal International, Regal International, coma, SADCB. Ok, nombre del curso, inglés principiante, módulo 2. Inglés. Principiante, módulo 2. Fecha de inicio, 9 de noviembre de 2020. Mm -hmm. 
Yesenia Magaña, usted que ya me lo terminó, a la captura cree que me le puede poner, a la parte donde me le puso listo, necesito que le ponga su nombre completo, por favor. Ok, íbamos en fecha de finalización, dijimos que era 10 de diciembre de 2020, la fecha de ahora. Gracias. El resto creo que ya es cuestión de ustedes. Thank you, Yesenia. Appreciate it. No, ya no. El resto creo que es cuestión de ustedes. Por favor, no lo vayan a cerrar sin tomármele la captura y ponerme, enviarme la imagen con su, con su nombre, por favor. Por favor. Si hay alguna pregunta, I'm here waiting. Aquí eh, el, nom el nombre del curso, Ticha. Inglés. Ok, ahorita se lo digo exactamente como nos aparece acá. Permítame que estoy como con tres chats diferentes. Ok, el nombre del curso es Inglés Principiante, módulo 2. Inglés Principiante, módulo 2. Thank you. Thank you, Mariela. Teacher, ya se le puede mandar la, la captura. Perdón. El grupo. Sí, 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 ya, ya lo tiene. La captura del grupo. Si ya la terminó, okay. envíemela. Ok. Thank you, Jorge. Thank you, Mariela. Thank you. Uh, who else? Natalie, Francisco, excellent. Thank you, Helen. Teacher, ¿en qué fecha iniciamos el curso? I'm sorry. ¿En qué fecha iniciamos el curso? Necesita la fecha de inicio. Ok. Uh -huh. La fecha de inicio fue 9 de noviembre de 2020. Okay. 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 ¿Quién me envió la última del setenta veintiuno? No me le puso nombre. Pedro, Antonio Hernández, thank you, Eliani, thank you, Carlos, Tras Fausto. Ok, I'm just missing a few of you. Yes, me faltan poquitos. This is very important, believe it or not. It's one of the parameters from Insafort in order to, to approve the course. Sí, soy la Noemi. Perfect. Thank you.
12. So I'm just missing four. Al grupo lo vamos a mandar, teacher. Al grupo o al otro número que les aparece ahí. Casi todos me lo están enviando al grupo. Ok. It's funny, your hood, Eliani. Excuse me? It's funny, your hood. You even got a little bowl. <laughs> it's <Okay>. cool. <laughs> hey, you're very romantic tonight. I can hear romantic music around. Who's that? Entonces, ¿de quién es? Somebody else. Somebody is listening to romantic music. <laughs> ah, Noemi, I'm sorry, Eliani. Noemi is the one who's very romantic tonight. Interesting. Thank you, Felicita. Thank you, Grecia. Who's still missing? ¿Quién me falta aún? I guess Miss Colocho. Blanca, you send it. Yes, Blanca did it. Yes, teacher, I see. Yeah, yeah, I just checked, Blanca. Thank you. So, oh, Carla Marielos. Walter, no me le puso nombre. Full name, please, Walter. Full name, full name. Nombre completo, por favor. Póngale ahí la referencia al, a la imagen, please. Carla Marielos, perfect. Thank you. Okay, everybody send it. Todos lo enviamos. Yes, nobody's missing. No me falta nadie. Okie dokie, so let's continue. Shall we continue now? Podemos continuar? Thank you, Miss Colocho. Yes, nobody's missing, right? Nadie me falta, verdad? Okay, well, thank you very much. Appreciate it. It's a requirement, you know. Perdonen por la intrusión, pero es un requerimiento. So let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay. Perfect. Let's continue. Well, as you saw in the example, we were working in the conversation, we were having a very, a little bit of informal conversation. They started talking among themselves using a, talking in a, speaking in a first name basis. That sets up the rhythm of the whole conversation because then they started talking like, could you and can you? So they were using both type of expressions. Now, okay, we are going to go to a little bit of the explanations, the explanation of this part. And I'm going to share again the, the screen. Okay, I'm going to share the screen right now. We are going to be working with page number 48. In page number 48, okay? What appeared there is the how to use first, cool, for polite and formal requests. Look, how to use cool for polite and formal requests. Now, let me take the picture so you can have the picture there. If you cannot see it here, you can check it out in the group. Okay, we use cool for polite and formal requests. The modal verb could is used for polite and formal requests. The structure, could, subject, verb. The verb, remember, in the base form. Why is the verb in the base form? Because we have could 
And could is a modal. Remember, whenever we have a modal, after the modal, we place a verb in the base form. Always, all the time. Recordemos siempre, si tenemos un modal, de, después del modal va un verbo en su forma base. Okay? Then the complement, and last one, the question mark. So we have could, subject, could plus subject, plus verb in base form, plus complement, plus the question mark. Examples. Could you write these reports, please? Could you deliver these letters today, please? If you see, in this case, we are, very, we are being very polite. Estamos siendo amables y formales, okay? Could you write these reports, please? Could you deliver these letters today, please? Okay? Now, when we use can, we use it for informal request. So can is used to ask informal request. Structure, can plus the subject, plus the verb in the base form, plus the complement, plus the question mark. The structure is the same. The only thing that varies is that in the formal and polite, we use could. In the informal, we use can, okay? The examples. Can you write these reports, please? Can you help deliver these letters today, please? So, remember, as I told you at the beginning, can, informal, could, formal, and polite, okay? Now, can, it's also polite. Cuando usamos can, también estamos siendo amables, okay? But not formal pero no formales. There's a difference. Because it's different if I tell uh, Carlos, Carlos, uh, Carlos, send the reports. That's an order, you see? That's what, what the boss comes and tells Carlos. The boss comes and tells him, hey, Carlos, send me the reports. I need them today. That's a request. But that's a command. Pero esa es una orden. You see? Now, a co-worker can tell Carlos, hey, Carlos, eh, can you send me the reports? Un compañero de trabajo le puede decir, hey, Carlos, can you send me the reports? No problem, it's informal. Now, imagine that Carlos needs a report that his boss has. Imagínese, Carlos necesita un reporte que tiene el jefe. O Carlos is writing to somebody in the United States or in Europe. He says, oh, could you please send me the reports? He's using could. Just from the moment that he places the could, he's being very polite and formal. Okay? Are we clear with this? ¿Entendemos bien esto? Yes? Okay, guys. Let's see if that's true. You're going to have four minutes, just four minutes, because at the end, I need to make a small review. Vamos a tener cuatro minutos. Okay. In those four, minute, four minutes, I, you are going to be working in pairs, and you are going to tell your classmate at least two formal requests that you do in your company. Okay? Vamos a decir, a mencionar, por lo menos, Dos formal requests que nosotros usamos en nuestro trabajo. ¿Ok? Two formal and one informal. ¿Ok? So, two using could, one using can. Let's start working. Let me recreate the rooms. Ok. Rooms are recreated. Please, let's do it. Hurry up, four minutes, then we come back here for the final review. Hello. Hello. Can you not access Helen? No puede acceder Helen? Um, 
yes, but mm, estoy solita, Mariela. No, Helen, usted está ahorita no, todavía en el main room. Todavía está en el salón principal. Okay, now she's in. Let's go and check. Sí. Cuando eh, okay. escuché uh -huh. que estaba diciendo que uno era para decirlo de forma formal, algo así. Yes. Sí. Could. Yes. Could. Could. Yes. Y el can es informal. Yes. Exactly. Yes. Okay. Vamos a hacer uno de. Sí, la verdad. Y más el trabajo. Ajá. You're complaining <laughs> about the teacher. Blanca. I got you. No. Me estoy quejando de la universidad. No, no, no. La pillé, la pillé. No, jamás dije teacher. I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Mm -hmm. Continue, ladies. I'll be back. Thank you. Teacher. Teacher. Yes? Vaya, este, usted dijo que le diéramos dos respuestas, una polite y una informal, ¿verdad? No, 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 no. no. Two formal, one informal. Ah, two formal. Yes, one two informal. using could, formal one using can. Ajá, pero cuando yo uso el could, yo contesto con el son, con el verbo to be. No, 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 it's not a conversation, it's not questions, ¿ok? Una pregunta, solamente oh, compar compártale ejemplos oh. de cosas que okay. usted dice normalmente en su trabajo. Ok. Mm -hmm. Ok, ok, thank you. You're welcome. I'm gone because Blanca is complaining about the teacher. <laughs> <laughs> I cool, cool, es ese. Sí, es Yes. And the other is, could you help me with my computer, please? No, I cannot. I don't want to. You're What? very problematic, Mariela. You and your computer Why? give me problems all the time, so I'm not going to help. My computer, my computer um, um, is trash. <laughs> <laughs> You're mean. Qué mala. I'll be back. Hurry up, hurry up. Just two minutes. Well, one and a half. And the informal uh, is, can you receive me the invoices, please? And the mm -hmm. other, can you check this report, please? Can you receive it? Can you, can you receive me the invoices? caso del Ken, a mis compañeros les pido fotocopias. Ok, you say, can you get me a photocopy, please? Can you, can you help me? Yeah, or you can tell them, hey, can you get me a photocopy, please? Simple. Can, can you get me? Yeah. Get me a photocopies. Please get me. Yeah. Sorry, teacher, my cell phone is crazy. I think the, the, the platform is giving problems. 
because you are not the only one. A lot of people went out. Varios se me salieron and tried to get in again. There's Walter. Walter changed the device. Wow. Look at this. Let's see. Let's see. Where's Walter? 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 I'm going to change his name. Oops. No. My bad. Okay, let's see. Rename. There you go. Now it says Walter Mauricio. Hello, 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 hello. Who's gonna start? Who wants to start? Let's see. Carlos, please tell me one formal request that you use in your company. Okay, a uh, formal request, for example, to my boss, uh, could, you, could you give me the expensive report? Please. Could you please give me the expensive report? Perfect. That another is, could you please authorize, authorize, authorize the payment order? Perfect. Thank you very much. Uh, let's see. Fausto, what about you, mister? Okay. Uh, could you pass me the purchase order, please? Excellent. An informal, please? Uh, can you get me the product, please? Okay. Nice. Excellent. Francisco, your turn. Okay, formal. I'm glad. Could you give me a day off, please? Oh, cool. That's <laughs> nice. Yeah. <laughs> a day off, un día libre. That's cool. Yeah, and um, informal. Um, can you put this over there? Okay, excellent. Thank you very much. Okay. Grecia, your turn. Formal. Could one and one. Okay. Could you help with report? Please. Please. Thank you. Could you help with report, please? And informal. Can help you make the list of the products. Okay. Excellent. Thank you very much. Noemi, what about you? Hello, Noemi. I cannot hear you. <laughs> okay. And the format. Uh, please. Could you give me this report, please? Report. Report, please. And could you print the check, please? Okay, excellent. Informal. Very well, very well. Very well. Let's see, what about you, Blanca? Um, call you, call this annoying customer, please. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Um, Could you call this annoying? Do you, I'm sorry, Blanca. Do you know what is annoying, guys? Um, okay. Annoying is molesto. So you got annoying clients. Yeah. The other, could you prepare the report, the piri cash, caja chica? Yeah, the piri cash. Piri cash, okay. And can you write a new form, please? Okay, excellent. Peri cash, peri cash, peri cash. Caja chica. Peri o piri? Peri. Peri. Yes, piri is lastima. How, how, actually, do you, how do you write, teacher? I send it on the chat. Okay, let me see. Peri cash. Oh, peri cash. Yes. Peri cash. Thank you. You're welcome. 
Now let's see, let's see who else, who else. Mariela, what about you? You did it already? Ya la dijo? No. Okay, please. Um, could you help me with my computer, please? Okay, now the informal. And informal, um, can you check this report, please? Okay, excellent. Now let's see who else, who else, who else, who else, who else. Um, Helen, what about you? Um, formal, could you attend, attend me today meeting, please? Okay. Uh, can you answer this phone call, please? Answer, answer. Uh, I'm sorry. Perfect. Eliani. Could you give me a, give me the job, please? And can you give me the accessories, please? The accessories. The accessories. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. Now, let's see, let's see, let's see. Who's missing? ¿Quién me falta? Pedro, Pedro, you're missing. Let's see, let's check. I cannot hear you. Perhaps he's having problems. Miss Carla Marielos, what about you? Oh, there's Pedro. Sure. Yes, tell me, Pedro. Es que se, no sé por qué la plataforma se, como que se le bajó el volumen y, y no, 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 escuch, no escuchaba. Okay, can you tell uh, us the uh, sentences? Um, have you go to the library? Okay. Uh -huh. um, and informal, uh, uh, same. Um, the other... Question, are you finished report for my boss? Um, informally, are you send your report? Okay, just remember that when it is a request, you use can. Thank you very much, Pedro. Okay. Natalie, Natalie, you've been very quiet. Please tell me. Oh, okay. Informal, can you send the Christmas bonus check, please? Okay. Cool. Next. Hello, Natalie. I think I lost you again. Don't worry, don't worry. Marielos, Sorry, Carla, please. no problem, no problem. Carla Marielos, please give me yours. Former, I call help make list at the product. I'm sorry? I call help make list at product. Okay, perfect. You are offering yourself. En este caso se está ofreciendo. Yes. Okay. Yes, when you use it in a question, you are requesting. Cuando estamos, este, cuando lo usamos en una pregunta, el could. Estamos pidiendo algo. But when we use it in affirmative, we are offering our help. Estamos ofreciendo nuestra ayuda. Okay. okay. Now, please, give me another one. In pharma, I can order product. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Now, guys, uh, let's see, let's see. For the rest of you, I'm sorry if I didn't call your name. Para el resto de ustedes, perdón si no mencioné su nombre. Let's make a small review. Let's see. All along this course, we have, we have talked about different topics. One of the first topics we were using is the simple present tense. Do you remember? We were talking about that simple present is used to state facts. We use it to express habits. We use it to express routines. Right? Do you remember? We were talking. We were talking also about schedules. Hablamos acerca de horarios. Then 
we touch another point that is the adverse of frequency. The adverse of frequency are very close linked with the simple present because they express the frequency, they express how often, expresan cuan a menudo la frecuencia, that we do something, right? Like, uh, I always brush my teeth, you see? That's the frequency. And I sometimes take a shower. A veces me doy una ducha. Sometimes. The rest of the time I stink. The rest of the tiempo pesto. Very simple, no? I am expressing the frequency. So remember, the adverse of frequency are commonly used with simple present. It doesn't mean that we just use it with simple present, but it's pretty common to see it with simple present tense. No quiere decir que solo se usa con el presente simple, pero es muy común verlos así. Now, something else that we were working on here was with commands. Hablamos acerca de los commands. But remember, they were orders, straight orders. Open the door, eh, give me the report. In commands, if you remember, I told you that we do not use a subject. En los commands no utilizamos un subject. Because the subject is always you, so you don't say it. El sujeto siempre es you. No lo decimos. Okay? After that, we were also working with have to and need to. And somebody asked me, Carlos, I guess, asked me the difference between have to and need to. Creo que Carlos me preguntó la diferencia entre have to and need to. Right? And I was explaining to him that the difference is very simple. Have to. It's an obligation, but it's an obligation that somebody puts on you. Es una obligación externa, es algo que le imponen a uno. Like Francisco, in your job, you have to attend the clients. Usted tiene que atender los clientes. It's an obligation. Somebody else told you to. Alguien más le dijo. But imagine that Carlos, or Fausto, Fausto has... If I am not mistaken, Fausto got many obligations, but some of them he told me that come with their job. Él me explicaba que algunas de las obligaciones vienen con el puesto, con la posición, el trabajo que él tiene. So, so some of them are not according to a specific schedule. No necesariamente van con un horario específico. So, he decides when he needs to do them. Él decide cuando él necesita hacerla. We use need to. When the imposition is personal, utilizamos el need to cuando la obligación es impuesta por nosotros mismos, es interna, okay? That's the way we do it. Like today, uh, today very early before the class I said to myself, este día antes de comenzar la clase me dije a mí, oh, I need to check the, if everybody finishes the exam. Yo necesito revisar si todos hicieron el examen. I could have done it after the class. Podría haberlo hecho después de la clase. But I imposed that obligation on myself. Yo me impuse esa obligación a mí mismo. That's the difference between have to. Have to, somebody else tells you. Cuando utilizamos have to, alguien más nos dice. Okay? It's an obligation. Something that there's no option. When you use need to, it's personal. Cuando usted utiliza need to, es personal. Comes from the inside. Usted se propone que necesita hacer esto. Yo necesito hacer esto, esto y esto. Okay? That's personal. Then, we were working with would. Do you remember? We were talking about possibilities. Right? Hablamos sobre las posibilidades usando el would. And we'd say like, uh, man, I think uh, I will... I would like a cup of coffee right now. Me gustaría. Okay? We use would for, for preferences. Lo utilizamos para expresar preferencias. Okay? And that's how we use the would like. Do you remember? We were doing some exercises with would like. Hicimos varios ejercicios con el would like to. I would like to dance. I would like to play soccer. I would like to swim. Then we came to can and could. Luego vinimos con el can y el could, and that's what I've been explaining in this class. Once topic 
that we also check in this course, otro tema que vimos en este curso, was also how to use the present continuous. Do you remember that present continuous is used to express two different ideas. One is to express something that is happening right in this moment. La primera es para expresar algo que está sucediendo en este momento. Like, right now I am watching Noemi, she's like sleeping. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Okay? She's smiling right now. You see? And the other one is when I use the present continuous to talk about a future arrangement. La otra es cuando lo utilizo para referirme acerca de un arreglo futuro. Yeah? Future arrangements, something that you have programmed, set, okay? Like, uh, or, and perhaps something that is also short term. También para algo que va, que está pasando, pero por un corto periodo de tiempo que va a finalizar. Like, I know that some of you are having a Christmas, Christmas lunch or Christmas dinner in your companies in this month. You see? Some of you are having Christmas lunch. Hey guys, I know that all of you are getting Christmas bonus. We are getting, we are getting Christmas bonus this month. Yeah, everybody gets a big smile. So we are getting Christmas bonus this month. You see? That's the present continuous for future. So that's mostly what we have done in this course. Eh, eso es más que todo lo que hemos hecho en este curso. Salto en inglés, salto al español, perdón. Ante todo, agradecerles a todos por su tiempo, su atención, el esfuerzo que han hecho por estar en clase y tolerarme. I know that sometimes it's not easy. And, hey guys, whenever you need some help, you got my number. Cuando sea que necesiten ayuda, tienen mi número. Eh, para el curso, para el siguiente módulo, estamos creo que hasta en enero. Le van a estar la fecha límite para enviar la documentación para el próximo curso es el 13 de enero, si no estoy equivocado. Eh, alguien me preguntaba ayer, creo que fue Walter. Este, por favor, vamos a descansar. Quiere decir que, if you really, really are into English, si realmente estamos interesados en el inglés, no descansemos. We dedicate, as I told Felicita yesterday, dediquémosle, como les dije ayer a Felicita, 10, 15 minutes daily. Do it. It's going to help you. Háganlo, les va a servir. You have access to the course. Tienen acceso al curso, to the video conferences. Tienen acceso a las videoconferencias. In YouTube. So, check them out. And if you need, if you want and if you need, si ustedes quieren y necesitan, text me and let me. Thank you. I expect to see you later, soon. Espero verlos pronto. And next time I get you, please speak English, no Spanish. Thank you, guys. <laughs> A pleasure. Bye bye. Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Have a good night. Bye bye. Bye bye. Have a good night. Uh, enjoy your vacation. Bye. Oh. Thank you, teacher. Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. Thank you, teacher. Smile, Marielos. Smile. <laughs> and she was very serious. Marielos, the party. Yeah, she's going to party all night. <laughs> Tomorrow. Oh. Continue, continue. Tomorrow continues the party. Excellent, excellent. <laughs> bye bye, guys. Thank Take you. care. Thank you, teacher. Bye. 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 Good night. Bye.